So this step is the radio antenna that goes in the right behind the seat. So on the plans, there's a picture of the antenna side view, and that long piece I'm pointing to is a length of wire that you cut, and then it is embedded in the actual antenna, which is that cutout that you see over there. So here are the parts. There's the main antenna. There's the piece of wire, which actually was too thick. And there's a tiny little piece of boot that goes around the bottom side, which I haven't actually put on yet. Don't know if I will, to be honest. Uh, but the first step is to um, take my little embosser and go along that middle line so I have a place to bend. And then I take my tweezers and very carefully bend it to get it to start to make a curve or make a, make a bend in the middle where it's going to go around the wire. So that's going to be a, a um, you know, the front end, the leading end, essentially. And then now you basically glue this in. Now you could use super glue or something. My super glue was plugged up, so I decided just to go ahead and use this regular glue I've been using. And this is all sped up because all this is is a matter of <coughs> tweaking it, squeezing it, holding it together. Um, one thing that did happen, and this is the first time it happened, was it actually delaminated on the front. So I had to go back here with a little root or a little uh, marker and try to cover that up a little bit so it didn't look so bad. That was sort of the first. I don't know why. Maybe that piece wasn't coated with acrylic. I'm not sure. But now you have this little antenna. Now, all you do is you take a little pin vise like that one. Any one, any pin vise will do with a little tiny drill. I think that was a, gosh, very small drill. I want to say a 62 or something like that in that range. The bigger the number, the smaller they are, I think. And I just very carefully drill down through the top where it's supposed to go vertically. So there's a little hole there. Um, oh, I realize that you can't see it, so I kind of reposition this. Oh, drop the airplane first. Then um, you can see that there's a little spot right there. And that's just very carefully drilled all the way down into the bulkhead and straight down. And then that piece just fits right in. The wire goes straight in there, and it's that way it's nice and strong and straight. Um, so all I need to do is put a little glue there and pop that down and straighten it. Make sure it looks half decent, which you know, it does. And it turns out that that little glue that I use, or the, um, the uh, just that white glue, is going to be enough. Um, now that it's all dry, it's just fine. So. Here I try to use it, use a super glue to attach it, but my super glue is stuck fast, and I can't get it out. The more I think about it, that would have been a dumb idea because the super glue will probably craze the clear plastic. So I'm kind of glad it didn't work. So that was a happy accident. And then in desperation, I just used the white glue, and the white glue has turned out <coughs> to work just fine. So I put a little teeny dollop on that point where the little antenna is going to go through the wire and then enough of that gets carried down into the other side that it glues fast and strong. Grab that, make sure you're going in the right direction forward and you just stick this right down in and you just make sure it's straight and then you spend a little time making sure it's vertical, making sure it looks like an antenna and you um, just let it dry. And now you have a nice antenna that we're going to actually, we're going to make little insulators for it, show you how to do that, or how, how I'm going to attempt to do that. And um, little uh, spring connectors for the antenna that will go between that and the rudder. So there is your antenna. Looks pretty good.